This is the price of one AVAX. And this is how much it gained in just one month. I want you to join me on the chart of Avalanche, where we will find all the answers regarding the price and possible scenarios into the future. Welcome to Cryptastic Park. Thank you for still being a part of this video. We will take a short term approach on the daily chart of Avalanche versus our biggest nemesis dollar. And I must say, at this moment, AVAX is stronger than dollar, yes? Now, yesterday I reviewed the chart of Polkadot and it's looking practically the same. Although Avalanche is looking somewhat stronger. We ended the downtrend here at the beginning of last month, so about a month ago and we were living in this down sloping line of resistance or if you want me to be exact we lived inside this widening channel that is showing us that the price of avalanche was pretty volatile and unpredictable now we did break to the upside because as this channel is pointing to the downside it means that there is a higher probability that eventually we break to the upside so water under the bridge let's move on that downtrend is history, let's not talk about it. On the short term, we are living in an uptrend. And it's pretty clear why and how. Connect those dots of support and you are getting that upward sloping support. So, short term bullish. There is no chit chat or going around the bush. We are bullish short term. Long term is a little different story. Remember, macro downtrend has still not changed. Although this is looking pretty, it could end still on the course side nasty. And soon I will show you one signal that could point that some pullbacks, pretty hard ones, could be ahead of us. But we must respect the facts and the fact is this is a uptrend. But remember that all good things are coming to an end and remember that this with conjunction with this line of resistance is either looking like a very squeezed channel to the upside or even worse a rising wedge and this arrow is pointing you the possibility of something that you maybe don't want to hear but it's in the making if this is a rising wedge if you see it just like i'm seeing it we could retest those lower regions 30 dollars sounds nice of today's price but much lower prices are in the cards especially those lows that we had in June. So, be cautious. Now, if we continue to ripping to the upside, based on this line of resistance, this point that we had in May, I would say that $36, yes, $36, is a possible scenario before that big pullback. And that scenario is looking something like this. And this is a bullish scenario. Of course, it's not mandatory that we go all the way to those levels. I just want you to have all the options open. So, price prediction to the upside, 36 at maximum. Then we really need the rest. But when we reverse to the downside levels, first level I want you to have in your mind is $20. Yes, it is possible $20 avalanche in the short term is a very, very real possibility. I'm not exaggerating. Resistance, resistance, look at this beautiful support. So this line has proven its worth. But this is not the worst case scenario. No, no, no. I really want you to be ready for something like this. $16. Still in the play, yes. The battles were ongoing at that local bottom. And here we found a great support. So, let me put it simply like this. If we go to the upside, I'm giving it 36 at maximum in the short term. If we go to the downside, expect $20 for sure and 16 as an extreme case scenario that is absolutely in the cards. From that point, if we get again to the 16, we will calculate all the possible targets beyond those. And yes, we are still in a macro downtrend, so lower levels are still a possibility. Don't get too cocky, you know it always ends bad. And in the super short term, I want you to be, let's say, conscious 
of 21 moving average simple moving average that was resistance many 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 many, many months and now a support so we must factually talk about avalanche in a bullish manner it is bullish but retracement to the level of 24 dollars when this moving average is standing right now is a hard truth and a possibility the thing is when we get to that 24 dollars will the price hold if not then we are going to realize those lower levels for now bull thread is ongoing but now comes the most interesting part that you might not have expected you see this line that is barely seen here on the screen yep it's something i'm never using but we'll do it for you now just to show you a signal of threat this ladies and gentlemen is well i know you guessed it rsi relative strength index something you might have already seen if you love technical analysis this is a pretty popular tool and i made a video about it it was a long time ago but it could still be relevant to you if you don't know how to use this tool here in the corner of this video now i will put a link so that you can click on this rsi tutorial okay this is what i want to show you on this rsi you see avalanche is pretty much from june from the occasional throwdowns below this trend line following this upward sloping line of support on the rsi so the strength is ongoing and the coin is getting stronger and stronger but can you see what is happening today on today's candle we broke into this overbought area as a first thing level of threat now that doesn't mean that we should instantaneously retrace to that moving average to this trend line but the market of avalanche in the short term is getting overbought what should you deduct from this rsi moving average and all this we are in a bullish uptrend in the short term but are getting overbought if you still are thinking about buying avalanche now i would literally think twice because it could get ugly by the pullback that the avalanche is waiting and the price will retrace all of these signs are telling you the price is about to retrace do not interpret them as something else this channel is showing you the factual state of the market not the pumpamentals and only the good stuff the reality my friend because if i won't show you your wallet will smack you in the face like you never thought it was possible expect higher prices they are a possibility but enter trades lightly at this moment it could get pretty volatile but not just to the upside but also on the downside also my recommendation for you would be to watch this video because in there i am discussing avalanche from the months and months and months ago on the different circumstances with a different price with a totally different sentiment thank you for watching i'll see you in that one